This is a follow-up video on the self-driving tap holder. So last time it didn't work so well because the part moved in the vise. Last time we are also tapping aluminium, so I want to give it a go in steel. I'm going to try and power tap this steel. See on parallels, everything's secure. This is about 13mm thick. Let's do it. One problem with this thing that I need to address is that detent pin at Cox is over, so it's hard to line up the hole. Power tapping test two. Okay, test three. This time I'm gonna try and go down, keep the key engaged so I can actually reverse it. It's definitely working. This is better than doing it by hand. Power tapping test four and, and power untapping hopefully. Worked fine. How about that? Holes aren't deburred and cleaned up yet, but. Something I intend to do with this tap holder. At the moment, it's just set for an M6 tap. I'm going to bore this out bigger and have insert bushings to suit different size taps. That way, I don't have to make a whole heap of these. Just want to say thank you to Emma and welcome to all the new subscribers. So, next project. Awesome transition. Next project quick change gearbox. Metric, Imperial, every single thread combination, and not a single change gear. Stay tuned.